Today, I'll be showing you how to quickly replace prefab instances in Unity 2022.2. We are adding some new capabilities for prefabs that I would like to show here. First, we'll cover how to replace one or more prefab instances with another. Then, we'll see how you can transfer over any overrides you may have added. And finally, we'll look at how to take an unpacked prefab and reconnect it back to a prefab asset. When selecting a prefab instance, notice that the inspector header has changed, and we now have a field that shows which prefab asset is being referenced. You can open the object picker and then click to pick a replacement. You can also drag prefabs to this field, or you can also find the replace command in the hierarchy context menu. And an even faster method is to drag an asset over an existing prefab instance in the hierarchy while holding Control or Command. Note that replacing prefab instances also works with multi-selections. Sometimes prefab instances have overrides added to them. When replacing an instance with overrides, Unity can automatically try to transfer over those overrides that will continue to be valid on the new prefab. Unity uses name matching to determine how to transfer those overrides. For instance, if I were to override the material of this prefab instance and I replace it, I can choose to keep that overridden material. If you have chosen to unpack a prefab instance and would like to reconnect it back to a prefab asset, you can do that with the reconnect prefab command in the hierarchy context menu. When choosing to reconnect, you will keep all the changes that were performed after unpacking as overrides. Thanks for watching.